Today, we're hitting up Brooklyn Boulders in Trappy School, New York, to find out what happens when two well and good editors try out the sports of their youth as busy, possibly jaded, gym-dwelling adults. Can you get out of your workout rut by making fitness fun again? Hey guys, it's Jordan from Well and Good, and this is another episode of House of Wellness with Reebok One. Today, we're in Long Island City. We're at Brooklyn Boulders to help one of our editors get back to her favorite childhood activity, rock climbing. I did a lot of outdoor activities. There are photos of me as like an eight-year-old, like way up high on a cliff face in Moab, Utah. So I was a champion, basically. But yeah, I haven't done that since I was like 13 and I am seriously skeptical about my skills today. I'm pretty terrified, to be honest. I'd really like to find something that I enjoy doing that doesn't feel like a chore and an obligation and can actually just be fun. Climbing with nice, straight arms like that. And then as you go up, you want to, as much as possible, try to use your legs as the generating force. All right. So Eva, you are on belay. You can climb when ready. Straighter arms. It turns out, Eva is still a pro. Time to move on to a harder wall. Now it's time to head across town to Trappy School, New York, and find out if Ella still got it. I was a pretty serious gymnast, flipping all over my front yard, flipping off the couch, flipping in the trees, pretty much always moving. No one had to tell me to wake up. These days, I spend the same amount of time hitting snooze that I do actually working out, and I've definitely just lost my spark. I have never done trapeze before. Mostly, I'm scared that I'm really gonna suck and that I'm gonna be super sore tomorrow. I'm hoping that today, flying through the air on these very high bars, I can reignite that passion. You're doing a trick called the knee hang. You're gonna grab two hands, all right, about shoulder width apart and thumbs under the bar. Holding that position, legs up. That's when you're gonna curl your knees in <laughs> and put those knees on the bar. Hands off, arch back, hands back up. Go ahead and grab that bar and legs down. Very good, Ella. Right. That was awesome. Let's go. decided to go for a flip. I'm so glad that you guys are daring because all it made me want to do is stay on the ground more than I already <laughs> wanted to. How does this compare to the gym or your regular workout routine? Rock climbing was so much more enjoyable because it wasn't just a solitary experience. You have a goal and an aim to get to the top. And Ella, what about you? Setting up a challenge made the whole workout a lot more engaging. By the end of my course today, I wanted to be able to do a grab. And that really takes your mind off of your abs and your butt and your arms and everything that's hurting and puts it on trying to complete something. And it's kind of a reminder that the gym is everywhere. Never stop moving and you'll never stop improving. <laughs> That's what guys. my mom says. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys. See ya.